Welcome to this special preview of the Vision Demolition Case. Be right back. What is that, a penguin? I'm reporting to you live from the helicopter pad atop Janus Quarters Security Bureau. In a few moments, Charles Perlman, <laughs> the, the accused, the cunning hares representing the citizenry, and others involved in the case, will, as is typical, travel to the new Eridu Supreme Court to await trial via the special court of law airship. The court proceedings will be streamed in full, and citizens are encouraged to follow the proceedings from home. Nicole, the airship is almost here, and you still haven't finished packing. <laughs> and on that note, Nicole, do you really need to pack so many things for court? Dang, man. How are you possibly going to go anywhere with all that? What do you know? The whole city's following Glasses? this case. In other words, it's a chance for us to make a name for ourselves. So he actually shows up in that suit. So, of course, I want to make sure I'm putting my best and prettiest face forward. I'm not kidding. I even printed off some flyers about us to pass around to potential clients out in the gallery. Doing all and anything for the monies. Well, something like that. At her face. Thank you. <laughs> huh? Nicole, what's wrong? Mm, nothing. Cancelled. Uh uh. Don't tell me. It's another deck collection message from one of our loan sharks. Nuh uh. Put a sock in it, Nekomata. Loan shark? Ellen? We don't owe anybody any money these days. Except for Faithen. And those other five loan sharks. Five? Why are there more dead? Nicole, what's going on? What is happening? Message from just now. How much money do you owe? Huh? What's going on? Who is that? So many messages. And they're all blank. Ugh, I can't take it anymore. <sighs> we made it. But where are the ballet twins? Just across the river inside the hollow. <laughs> it's a big Did hollow. Did message really come from the hollow? <gasps> Wait! Look above the hollow! That's the top of the ballet twins! Billy moves so oh, much for it. no reason. I'd heard the companion hollow had shrunk recently, oh. and that's left the top of the building exposed. So that means Nicole got that bizarro <laughs> message from there, right? Even if that's true, what was Rain doing in a place like that? Okay, team. First, let's think of a way we can get ourselves up there. They, just, they have too much fun with the animation. <laughs> We're here. The ballet twins. Ooh. What? It's impressive. Oh, this is Victoria Housekeeping. How's the bamboo sweating? Oh lord. Entry into Target Hollow, Ballet Twins area. Oh, it's even dark in the TV. The ballet buildings were lost to the hollow ages ago. The lights inside don't work. We'll have minimal oh, visibility shoot. on the shoot. <sighs> we did it. Anby, what you felt. That was the Ethereals, right? Hmm, not sure. Was it? So, manager, uh -oh. where should we go from here? Hang on, let me check. Is it like a frozen? Oh! Take off your whole head! Who's <gasps> there? Hmm. 
know what time it is. Shark time. You are all very skilled. Oh. It's no wonder you're able to walk around the building unhindered. But please, stop there. Oh, we'll enemy the are twins are private property and are currently closed to visitors. I will allow you 30 seconds to explain your presence before I decide whether or not. Oh, Corin. <laughs> Corin. <clears throat> In short, this place is not currently open. To uh, you lost all I... your scariness. It's gone. I'm sure I have stressed. Both the floors and one's weapons should be kept in pristine condition, have I not? It's sorry, over. Mr. Lycon, I'm really sorry. <laughs> it's so tired. Ellen, stay on task. Professionalism. Coming. Hmm? How'd you throw the... Is that you? Huh? Oh, Miss Nicomata. And the investigator. Corin, do you know them? Yes, Mr. Lycon. Oh, yes, yeah, They're the nice people who helped me out of Hollow that time. <laughs> I see. Rena, for now, you may stand down. Rena? As you wish. When did you... <laughs> You're quite a perceptive young lady. You almost saw me. She means you were way off, way off, way off. Oh, they can talk? Trespassers. That makes things easier. Allow me to introduce ourselves. We are Victoria Housekeeping. Nice. Victoria Housekeeping. I was a... Never heard of you. That was a good introduction until Corin dropped her razor in and then <laughs> kind of ruined the surprise. <laughs> I mean, like, it was good overall, but in, in terms of the scary, like, we don't, we don't like you. Corin kind of ruined that. <laughs> Why are they staying in this dump? This place looks like a barren building with nothing inside of it. Why are they here? Oh, so that's a new area. Ooh, okay. LA Twins Road. It's Alan. There's Joe. I mean, there's uh, Corin. There's Alan. There's Joe. And the, uh, the others are so slow. If they mess up now, the media will sensationalize it. Ah, they're coming out. They're coming out. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, moments ago, the defendant in this case, Charles Perlman, arrived at the helipad escorted by authorities. Shockingly, despite the crimes he's being charged with, Perlman shows no signs of being Yeah, worried. didn't last time. Oh, what was his name? Like Sasha? Sarah? <laughs> Saw Fools. him. Saw her coming here. A real surprise is yet to come. Yeah. I accept your request. I'll put the instructions in your suitcase for the day you board. Open it two hours after takeoff. Do what the instructions say. And someone will help you get out of New Eridu. Sounds familiar to you. Hey, where's my suit for court? Did the suitcase come? It's right here. It's right here, sir. Good, bring it over. What are you so smug about? It's about to hit the. Hey, Wait, hold on. Real surprise, ladies and gentlemen. Moments ago, the defendant in this real surprise is yet to come. I accept your request. I'll put the instructions in your suitcase for the day you board. Oh, uh, okay. Open it two hours after takeoff. Do what the instructions say, and someone will help you get out of New Eridu. Hmm. I feel like she's baiting him. Hey, where's my suit for court? Did the suitcase come? I feel like she's baiting him. But then again, she was talking to him in private, so maybe it's not a bait. It's right here. Good, bring it over. What are you so smug about? It's about to hit the fan, Pearlman. See, this is this is the real question here. Is he being baited? And he's smirking because he thinks that she's looking out for him? Or did she really help him out and he does actually have a plan? Because he doesn't he doesn't even know what the plan is. He's about to read it. Hit the fan! <laughs> Young lady, you've no idea how horrible this city can get. <laughs> Just you wait. Whatever tricks you have up your sleeve, I'll make sure you get what's coming to you. Pause. Great. You guys finally made it. I'm sweating to get there. <sighs> I'm beat. You're running for so long. How come 
you look fine, Billy. <laughs> the respiratory module I swapped out a few days ago has an anaerobic mode installed. It boosts energy efficiency during workouts. And it fails. Hmm? Oh no. I can't switch back to intake mode. I told you not to use that cheap black market junk. All right, cut it out. Does it really matter if Billy can't breathe? The airship is small anyway, and the air quality isn't great. <sighs> what? Does that really matter if he can't breathe? I mean, he's a robot, but... God dang. What's wrong, Anby? Something bothering you? I was just thinking. We left Faith into a group of strangers from a housekeeping company. Is that really okay? No matter if he can't breathe, right? Clearly. Nikomata knew one of them, right? And besides, the ballet twins belongs to their master, so the proxy shouldn't be in any danger. Wow. That's not it. I'm concerned once the proxy works with another squad, they'll notice a significant difference in the quality of service and won't want to work with us again. Oh, that's a good point, yeah. He's afraid that the Victoria Housekeeping Squad will be too good to work with. So she'll never come back to Cutting Hairs again. But don't be silly, Ambie. The Cutting Hairs are first class, I'll have you know. Besides, we have a relationship with Faithen. Those guys, they're completely new. Nothing to worry about. Sure. Nedge. And also... They should call themselves Gentle House. Well, I guess Cunning Hairs works too, but they're both the same. Oh. The lights are flickering faster. Let's hurry, everyone. Right. You can rely on us. Oh, I forgot Alan was here. Nice. This way, please. <laughs> Good thing, boo. Mind your step now, dear. Oh, instead of flying. <laughs> I'll do my best. Jeez. Dios. Oh my, are you hurt? I'm up there. The atrium is just ahead. <laughs> Not good. <laughs> oh, my door is shut. Hmm. Unfortunately, we are a step too late. The automated partition has completely closed. That was sick. Oh no, we were so close to getting through. That was sick. Dude, it's so funny to see the big move run for his so life. Oh. It opened. Great. It's thanks to our great guide that we could restore power so quickly. Oh, this looks really bad. Our master will surely be grateful too. Oh, don't mention it. Bad news. Over there, what's that? Huh? That's... Hmm? Do you recognize this backpack? Yeah, that definitely she belongs to Rain. She has such control of that thing, boo. Here. There might be some clues inside. Huh? That was a bomb. Oh. Ugh. Oh, that's that thing. That's the ballet twin. Just very sharp. Where did that come from? Since we've been invited to dance, I suppose we should oblige. Nice. Oh, dang. Find How can you stand? Guide. How can you balance on that thing? Like him. What a difficult guest. It appeared out of nowhere when the music started. Does that mean that? Hey, Ethereal, hmm? over here! Stop the box. Oh. Uh, lucky 
there was a rift. It was attracted by the music. It seems someone is trying to use ethereals against us. Did Rain do this? No, she couldn't. Huh? Oh, missile barrage? Dang. Wouldn't that explode? Ellen, leave one of them conscious. Ah, too late. <laughs> so there's well, people here besides us. But who are they? Leave one of them uh, conscious. Thanks for that just now. <gasps> Ellen, are you okay? She needs help. It's nothing. She's just asleep. Needs candy. So fuzzy. Oh. <sighs> It doesn't appear that they'll be waking up anytime soon. We should get them out of the hollow. Yeah, even the Bang Boo has so much emotion where it's almost as if Belle is the Bang Boo. Just like a little bunny with two circle eyes. Let me tell you something! Let me tell you something! Oh. Let me tell you something! 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 That is so good. Gonna give me oh oh that's Priscilla or one of them it's like a knife or something the suitcase oh that's the suitcase that uh the vision dude wanted oh no the equipment forget about it retreat mm. uh oh oh dear leaving so soon dear guest Leaving so soon. That's terrifying. Time for a nap. Well, that's one eye. <laughs> nap time, nap time. Bonk. Uh, Mr. Lycon. We've done a full Ellen's sleep, but the sleep. Mr. Lycon. Lycon. We've done a full sleep, but there's no sign of Miss Rain. Was that a different inflection? We've done a full sweep. But there's no oh, sign okay. of Miss Rain. Looks like these are just the henchmen. The hostage must be with their leader. Lycon, what's this device they had on them? Looks like some kind of transmitter. Smartest werewolf ever. You are correct. This is a military issue G03 multi frequency signal transmitter. It's quite powerful. So, watch that mouse. Along with the right multimedia devices. It could even aid intelligence operatives in hacking into high-level security systems. Wow, I'm surprised you know about this sort of thing. What kind of work do you usually do? Everything. I apologize if that surprises you. For housekeepers such as us, this is simply common knowledge. Uh, oh, gosh. Really? Well, at least now we can confirm they kidnapped Rain for her hacking abilities. Rain... Raining is cancelled. Hey, I found this with all the enemy's crap. Wait a sec. Hey. Isn't that the airship the court uses? Timetables, route maps. They even have hardware diagrams of the integrated control system. Master, there was an incoming call from Billy. Allow me to connect you. Hey, manager, is that Billy. you? We've got trouble! Things just went down big time on the airship! Like Amada's passed out. Sleeping on her nap, her her, uh, her nap. Sleeping on her lap. Ambie's out. Calm down, Billy. Tell us what happened. Police members are out. <sighs> okay, so like ten minutes ago, Perlman said he needed to check his suit, and the guards okayed it. Oh, every human is asleep, but Billy's not human. But the moment he opened his suitcase, smoke exploded everywhere. God dang it! I knew she set him up, man. I knew she set him up. Knew there was gonna be like it just wasn't gonna be like some kind of thing to help him out. It was gonna mess him up. But I didn't think he was gonna mess up at everybody. Then everyone on the ship passed out, including the pilot. I was saved by my air intake malfunction. Mm. What? So who's flying the ship right now? It's an autopilot. Uh, it won't no be one. crashing for now. But manager. I noticed something. Its scheduled route has been changed. Sarah did nothing wrong. It's flying straight toward the hollow where the Bellay twins are! Oh, Sarah's up to something. Won't be long now 
now until we plunge straight in! This is kind of, a uh, terrible. You're telling me that there's a giant airship crashing into the Ballet Twin Tower? Looks like this is Rain's handiwork. Monka E. Took control of the airship. Wait, Captain. Didn't the employer ask us to bring her back and find out how much she leaked? <sighs> they're already on to us. We won't get away if we're stuck carrying dead weight. Bro. We were paid to do a job. We completed our primary task. There's no point in putting our lives on the line. We'll just say she didn't survive the ether corruption. Dang. <laughs> Goodbye, Rain. Sorry. But it's, it's nice knowing you. For knowing too much. I guess nice barely knowing you. 07. Bzzz. Coming in clutch. Oh no! They're taking a hostage! Oh, they said I'm taking a I took hostage. Or I've been taking hostage. Oh! Thwack! Thwack! Damn it! Leave the hostage! Everyone, retreat! Should we pursue Sir Lycon? No. Saving Miss Rain and the airship is more important. Yeah, Rain? I can't do much Rain? there. Are you okay? Don't worry, you're safe. We're friends of Nicole. We're here to save you. You're... You're really here to save me? Quick, get to the rooftop. We're running out of time. The course airship is about to... Oh, shoot. Oh, no, it did happen. What was that? It came from above. I'm afraid this won't be easy. Reporting in, Captain. The timed explosives have detonated as planned. Hollow structural changes have been detected. The path to the rooftop is gone. Copy that. <laughs> they took the hostage back, but they can't save the airship now. That's right. If all we need is to break it's control like the, the airship, I can disable the jamming equipment as soon as we reach the rooftop. She got the eye color and the pink hair. <laughs> Not picking up. We're here. That's the exit. Looking for another ballet to break through. robot. Right. Huh. Wait, something isn't right. The music, isn't it the same as before? It's the ethereal from the atrium. It's back. Oh my gosh. Our guests haven't had enough fun it's yet. Capitano. <laughs> Just like this. Oh! What? There's two of them. Is the story actually true? <laughs> We're running out of time. Rest assured, Master Proxy. For Victoria housekeeping, it's plenty of time. Why did you give me that? This is our command. Let's go. Here, hold this. Shoot! Oh, so it's the same time. I had a feeling too. It was the same time kind of thing. The twins. They did See ya. It. They left. Our mission continues onward. Oh wow, that was dangerous. I bust out the window. Can you hear me, Bell? The airship is almost there. It's the manager! Manager! Stop! Over Stop here. it! Billy! Warning, the airship will reach the target location in 20 seconds. <laughs> what are you Ten doing? Seconds remaining. Hurry up! We're not gonna this is such a controller at the last minute. Five, four, like about a wolf. Three. That's some kind of reference. Holy hell. Here we go. This is it. Nedge. Good work. Oh, we did it. He landed it? We got everyone out. Dang, like him. Your honor, I I object. 
still asleep. How are they doing? Don't worry. It was a strong anesthetic, but they'll wake up in an hour or two. Dang, what, was, what the heck was in so the suitcase just had a bunch of sleep gas in it? There's a lot of sleep gas that fell up the whole plane. But again, I guess the plane is kind of narrow. We owe you big time, Lycon. Ah, oh, you're too kind. We are honored to have worked with you, Master Proxy. You came through. It is thanks to your assistance we were able to safeguard our master's honor. Word from public security is that the rescue squad and Air Force are on the way. Billy, we can't let Rain get taken in by public security. Her identity as a hacker is unique, and she hacked into the airship while under duress. We'll take her into the hollow and make our exit from there first. All right. You know how to deal with get some in more intel right? on Rain, more information on Rain. I guess she did go to the video store, so. I didn't inhale the gas, so I piloted the airship here for an emergency landing upon discovering what had happened. Oh, right. Speaking of which, after all that's happened, can we still hold the vision trial? Billy reminds me of a nice Deadpool. Public security will likely take Perlman back and then reopen the trial. A nice, clumsy de de uh, Deadpool. I'll leave this to you then, Billy. We'll get going. Take care, guys. Thud. Uh, thanks. Punishing evil and upholding justice is the mission of the cutting hair. Huh. Still saying <laughs> that as you <we're> sleep. <sighs> I wonder what Nicole's face is going to look like when she wakes up and finds out what happened today. Uh, no speech for them. Hmm? What's that sound? <laughs> Wait, the captured Perlman? Perlman? Huh. Weren't expecting me to wake up so soon, were you? What are you doing? Those bastards. They pretended to agree to my demands, but they wanted me dead from the start. If I get taken back to public security, I doubt I'll even make it through the night. The way things are, I better get the heck out of New Era, do pronto. I mean, if you know how to fly that thing, then I guess he escaped. Guess he got out. But he's, he's uh, looks like he's leaving New Era, do though. Or he's gonna try to. Oh, that guy really got away quick. Well, since it's you asking, <laughs> I guess I don't have any reason to hide anything. She has a Sibwater shirt, or it's... This is like, it's a, the cloud crossed out with rain under it. Does she want her identity to be known? I, I guess so. She has a bunch of, she has like a hair piece on her hair with rain. With a butterfly. And ins inside the jacket, it's a bunch of raindrops. I guess she wants people to know? In that case... Do the honors. Oh boy. Loading audio. Please wait. Ah, oh, shit. It is. Looks like I underestimated. Is he fighting Sam from Star Rail? It's my old man. Sounds like he's hurt. <laughs> Calm down, sweet pea. This recording was years ago. Yeah, still. <gasps> Horse is talking to someone. I told you, pretend you know nothing, and we'd all be fine. <coughs> I'm a father. <coughs> How could I let something that threatens my daughter's life go free? Mm. It's not going down without a fight. Dad. You idiot. I just come back to Oh, because we got this to decipher it. I know I'm not gonna make it. Just tell me. The monster in the monument. What is it? Okay. Consider it your last. 
Leroy Jenkins. A sacrifice. What did he say? So the vision. S sacrifice. Wise. Did he just say sacrifice? What's up with you two, Faithen? That name. We've heard it once today already. Say what? A reliable source informed us that the reason someone was going after the court's airship was to do away with Pearlman. And those same people mentioned the word sacrifice. What's the connection there? The name of that machine that Koyta's father took out was sacrifice and Vision wanted to get rid of Pearlman? What? Wait, so Pearlman is somehow related to what we're investigating? Took the words right out of my mouth, Kaleida. But Pearlman hasn't been heard from since he stole the airship. He's probably already run off to the Outer Ring, right? What's any city that's not New Eridu? All right. We'll just have to find out what's going on over there then. Oh, well, I guess back to the lore video, like the chasm and all that. That's like where he could be headed. Probably not the chasm, but one of the other areas. I don't know. Like how? I never expected to be investigating the same matter as our guide. Sir Lycon, they know about the sacrifice. Is it okay to let them continue their investigation? Well, what do you mean, is it okay to let us... Uh, hold on a second. What? I'll pull the plug? So we're all looking for a sacrifice. It's no issue. Master has had a change of plan and given us new instructions. And then who's their master? Provide them assistance or guidance as needed. They're too involved to keep them out. But perhaps they can become our allies. To like own, please stop us out of way any shuffle. What the heck? So we're all looking that that escalated very quickly, so we're all looking for the same thing. They highlight they highlight the outer ring like we're gonna go there. We set the shepherd and see if we can hook us up with some jobs in the outer ring. Oh, so is this gonna be is this the cutoff? Is this 1.1? I'd be shocked if this still continues in 1.0. Life has returned to normal, rebuild the internet account. Oh shoot. Wait, Anton? Oh. Dang, alright. Well yeah, so that was I suppose that was the 1.0 stretch of of content. Um, I, I do like how that all kind of wrapped up with all of us looking at the same thing towards the end. I had a good time with the very first chapter, but I think uh, the last two were definitely really good. Like, uh, let's see, Atheon, Business, Cat Found. Oh yeah, the Hollow Zero part was cool too. That was like a little side thing, but that was definitely cool cutscenes. Yeah, the Kaleida and Victoria housekeeping part were definitely the highlights. But yeah, it's cool how it all kind of came all to the same thing. They're looking for sacrifice, the Victoria House Squad, and Bella Bog. Well, Bella Bog just found out about it, and now we're trying to look into it too. So I'm excited to see what happens next. That was a good. That was a good cliffhanger. But it wasn't, it wasn't like, oh, come on, you know what I mean? It, but it was a good cliffhanger, like, okay, that's a good point to stop at, you know? So, yeah, can't wait for 1.1.